Welcome to my Idaho cabin Where the elk and deer run free Welcome to my Idaho cabin Hope you spend a little time with me Hi everybody, this is Rick. Welcome to my Idaho cabin. This afternoon I'm going to be doing a really easy and delicious meal for you guys. It's called Chicken Divan and it's made with pre-cooked chicken and pre-cooked broccoli and you just put it together stick it in the oven for about 30 minutes and it's done. It's ready to go. So here's how we do it. I have here a pan uh, that I'm going to put, to, I'm going to layer some, this is pre-cooked chicken and I'm going to layer the, uh, the chicken in there in bite-sized pieces, just kind of shred it and when I get this chicken in there, I'll bring you back. Okay, here's the chicken. As you can see, I've just broken it up into small pieces, bite-sized pieces, uh, with my hands. Now I'm going to put broccoli in there, and there are the florets. Just uh, toss them in there. These have been steamed about uh, six or seven minutes, so they're still crisp tender. So, sorry about the noise. We'll just put those on top. And then I'm going to make a cream sauce for this. So I'll show you how that's done uh, right now. Now for the sauce, I have two cans of cream of chicken soup and two cans of cream of mushroom soup. I'm making a double batch because this... Uh, this is a little bit more than what the recipe calls for. To that I'm going to add uh, mayonnaise, sherry, cumin, and lemon juice. So let's go ahead and make that, uh, mix that up. There's the mayonnaise. Sherry. cumin and lemon juice. All right, now I'm going to mix all this up and then we're just going to pour it over the uh, broccoli. I may not uh, use all of this, but we'll just see how it goes. Yeah, I think I will. This is a nice saucy dinner. And it really, really takes the flavor. It is great. The thing, the thing I really like about this dinner is it's so easy to do. If you get a like a rotisserie chicken at the store, just break it apart, and that's your there's your chicken. It takes you uh, what five to seven minutes to uh, bust apart a, a head of broccoli and uh, steam it, maybe ten minutes, and then you put all this together, and we're going to put some cheese over the top to make it even better. And uh, then on top of that, I was going to go some buttered breadcrumbs. There we go. That looks about right. And we're going to put some buttered breadcrumbs on there. And then we're going to throw it in an uh, 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 oven, a 375 degree oven, for about uh, 25 minutes or so until the cheese is melted. I did mention cheese, right? Well, anyway, a bunch of cheese goes on top of that, too, so what could be better? Okay, now we're going to put the cheese on top. I have about a, two cups of sharp cheddar cheese. Let's see if that's going to be enough. If it isn't, we'll just grate some more. Not a big problem.
That's probably enough. Okay, now here's some uh, breadcrumbs mixed with uh, melted butter. And I'm going to sprinkle those over the top. That's smoky. That's nobody at the door. So anyway, there we go. Now we'll get those. Those will get nice and toasty. I think that's probably enough. Okay, and now a little paprika. Yeah, make sure it's paprika and not uh, chili powder. That would not be good. Dress it up just a little bit. Okay, there it is. Quick, clean, cheap, and efficient. And there's the chicken divan. And there we are, ready for dinner. Well, thanks again for watching My Idaho Cabin. I hope this chicken divan recipe uh, strikes home with you because it's really simple and it's really good. It's elegant enough to uh, serve at uh, fancy dinner parties. And in fact, it's served quite a bit. Uh, so really all you need is a is pre-cooked uh, chicken. Get a, a ro pre-roasted chicken at, your, uh, at the supermarket, you know, one of those rotisserie things. Bust it apart, break it into bite-sized pieces. Uh, steam a little fresh broccoli uh, or frozen broccoli if you have some in the freezer and uh, throw it together, mix a couple of cans of soup together and some spices and you're good to go. It's a great meal, economical, and it's really, really elegant. Um, sometimes you serve it over a bed of rice. That's the way it's usually served. Uh, last night uh, we have some non-rice eaters and so we did it without the uh, rice last night. But uh, to make a, a more, even more elegant uh, uh, presentation and to make it go further, frankly, uh, serve it over a bed of rice. It's really, really good. So, uh, hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, if you did, uh, click on the subscribe button or the like button down below. I'd really appreciate that. And as usual, the recipe will be right down here. And I uh, hope I got that right. Um, and uh, I'll see you next time uh, on My Idaho Cabin. Welcome to my auto cabin Where the elk and deer run free Welcome to my auto cabin Thanks for spending time with me